Hey guys, what's going on? Third Street Reactions here. We're back with Shane. Zach. We're back with Star Wars The Clone Wars. We're watching Chronological Order, and this is what we're on. Zach, last episode, uh, we got introduced to the younglings. We had an Athorian, we had a Rodian, we had a... Wookiee. A Wookiee, a human male, and can't remember the other species' name. The but thing with the little tendrils with the fat ends on them. You know what? You're right, it's probably in there. It's in here. Is, is it in that one? Yeah. Was she on the council? Was she in episode one? Yeah, I don't think She's probably not in here. Wait, there she is! Oh, it's literally... Adi Gallia, born I... into a highly placed diplomatic family on oh, Coruscant, the intuitive... It doesn't say what species she is. Maybe back then when they made this, they didn't know. Oh, Tholoth. Tholoth? Tholoth. Tholoth headdress. That's Tholoth. just a headdress. Tholoth. Yeah, but it's Tholoth. Like, he's an Iridonian Zabrak. Yeah, it doesn't say her damn species. Is she just... A... I'm, I'm gonna go with Tholoth. I fucking hate the Gungans. I'll tell you that right now. You, I know. Yeah, I, it's I a hate different perspective. The Two sides of the same coin, man. But so. Jar Jar, I understand he's annoying. But I think the other ones are like Tar Captain Tarple. Tarple. He's cool. And those he went. Things, those things are bad. And he went like. The Jordicas are uh, they're, they're like a mechanical. Something about their mechanics. Yeah. Just fucking. But yeah, Tarple off. was a badass. Oh yeah. So uh, no, it, it was it was a cool episode. Like I don't remember ever watching it so it was kind of my reaction as well so i do know this arc continues mm -hmm. so you're going to get an authentic reaction from me again and uh i'm trying to think of anything else really nothing i mean ahsoka was in it i know nothing else that's that's pretty much it guys before we jump in uh check us out on patreon we have our full length uncut we also have four weeks early access let's go yeah. I, I feel like they more often are than not yeah. Those look good. Those actually, he did the Anakin thing. Mm -hmm. Mine's back. Call that move the whirlwind of destiny. Show off. Destiny. Kind of lame. Michelangelo, I forgot about that. Can everyone gather around, please? You have all successfully passed the gathering and harvested your crystals. Mm -hmm. That kid walk around with open back like that on her shirt. So yeah. when do we start to build our safe? Unfucking acceptable. You mean Ahsoka? Yeah. Yeah, team. she's a little young. <laughs> Lightsaber designer, Huang. These are them. I swear they get younger every expedition. But he's a droid. You expect us to learn from a droid? Who said that? I'll say it. Many years I have been on the ship. Did you Hurry the fuck said that? <laughs> Call me what you want, but inside my memory banks, I contain a record of every lightsaber ever made and the Jedi who fashioned them. Which will you choose? A simple grip? The curved approach, one inlaid with the bone of the Cartusian whale, Bastilian ore, or black onk. Is that the guy that played a Doctor Who? Yeah. Yeah, he, he plays Doc Scrooge's voice in the new DuckTales series. Yeah, David Tennant. Yeah, he was also in the uh, uh, Harry Potter series as uh, Barty Crouch Jr. No, that's not David. No, is that David Tennant? It is David Tennant, motherfucker. I'm telling you, it's him. You're right. Gosh. Yeah. A Wookiee. Rare you are to the Jedi. Proud your people must be. Unique. Just as your lightsaber will So he was in the Ahsoka trailer. Your hand. Yeah. What will make you strong in battle and humble in retreat? What connects with your force? <coughs> ah, yes, wood. Not a common choice. And only wood from the Brylark tree is as strong as metal. Let me see, where would we find that? All the way out here. Let's see what we have. Let me see. Let me... I like his design. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I wonder where I'd put that. It is my job that before you leave this ship, you will have everything you need to build your lightsabers and the knowledge of how to do it. So let us begin. There is much more work to be done. He reminds me of the one guy. Oh, yeah. That's what I was thinking earlier. Uh, that was what's like the actor's name? It's John Noble. You mixing up your nobles again, or your Johns? We talked about this before. No, because I was right the last time. John Noble's from Running Scared. That guy who plays the one guy is Fuck Noble. Uh, you're right. Mm. Oh no! I thought we weren't going to mess with Jedi anymore. My sources say they're just younglings headed back to the Jedi Temple. Don't hurt. Yeah. The most happen. important treasure in the universe. Kind of crystals. Used for making laser swords. 
What's the rush, Petro? With this lightsaber, I'm going to challenge Obi-Wan Kenobi to a duel and kill Grievous. The only person you are going to kill with that, my young friend, is yourself. You have inverted the emitter matrix, which will cause the power grid to backfire. Light this, and all that will be left of you and your lightsaber will be your crystal. Start again. You see the latest scene of Luke on Tatooine, he was building his lightsaber, and they cut it out. But uh, in the book, like, it talks about from Obi-Wan's teachings. Remember, how it's like the one deals with tests. And he was going to get R2 to turn on in case it blew up, but he's like, I need to do it myself. Mm. Good. Gently. Trust the force. Damn shame. I wish they'd edit this and re release them in theaters. Honda, what are you doing, man? I like the sound of that. Being a I'll pirate. Check on the <laughs> Excellent shot! Fire the grappling harpoons! He's so reluctant. What's happening? We're being boarded. Quickly, give me your crystals and I will hold on to them until we are safe. Nope, he kept one. Ah. Oh. Kid, don't you learn? He's kicked his own, his own friend. Mm -hmm. Well, they're fucking ugly ass, whatever the hell they are. Weak, weak ways. Yeah, those ugly sons of bitches. Yeah, you know, this non attractive species, you know? No wonder they're so angry and taking yeah. out on everybody like else. Like the people in the Iron, the iron <laughs> Islands or whatever. Yeah. That guy. Save me. I'll be one of the people from the Iron Islands. You're not fucking ugly, though. <laughs> yeah. Heck, I'm not gonna argue you how handsome you are. I'm done doing it. I win. Perhaps we should hide in the ventilation shaft. Follow me. Time to go. Uh, is this part of our training? It is now. Shut the fuck up and get in the hole. Come on. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Hondo says find the kids and bring them to him. Dead or alive? <laughs> just laugh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gnody and Zad, I need you to get to the cockpit. Zad. Find R2 and secure it. What are you going to do? I'm going to reroute enough power to the engine so that we can break free of the pirate ship's hold on us. Once the docking tube is ruptured, when the ships pull apart, a vacuum will be created, which will suck the pirates off our ship and into space. Ask your way to go. Do not engage the pirates. Your only job is to stay hidden. Do you understand? Now go. You know what? They're pretty loud. The fuck yeah, they are. I'm one of them just arguing. I thought maybe that's going to uh -huh. lead to them getting caught. Yeah. I smell profit. Ha <laughs> ha. Nice, juicy, fat, warm profits. <laughs> We've secured the ship, but she seems deserted. Imbecile. That is the oldest trick in the book. Weak-minded fool. <laughs> right? Ventilation system. Oh, uh, right. Uh, didn't think of that. Why does that not surprise me? All that matters is you Haven't you seen Die Hard? And bring me the First one. And the... I mean, the he's like talking oh. to them. <laughs> Fucking Carl's in it. Carl. From, uh... Yeah, Family Matters. Yeah. yeah, he's a cop in that too, right? Yeah. Poor R2. R2's a badass. He should be able to do something. Thanks, buddy. Drag him in there. Come on. Can you tell everybody else? Something's wrong. What are you gonna do? You use a force to. Well, hello, girls and boys. I've been looking forward to meeting ya. Now be nice and hand over your crystals. Over my dead body. Which one of you is first? All bark, no bite. Ah, that's for me. <laughs> Everybody get down! That's cool. I mean, I would have turned it on the, in the first place. Hell no. it on and off, yeah. Let's go. Yeah, it was... It was ballsy. Yeah. Stupid, but ballsy. Yeah. 
Like Jamon Green jumping on people. You could have killed him. Look, we can keep running or we can stand and fight and show these pirates we're not afraid. I cannot approve of such action. Besides, I have been damaged and I cannot aid you in battle. You need him battle to Right? Zeth, come in. I am overriding the emergency power fail safe and routing energy to the engines. It's working. Any word from the others? So that voice. The hold? He's great. Uh, Sipes, right? Not yet. Didn't hear Greg from Sipes? Them. Yeah. Great. I, so. I know what that means. Set them to the highest level. <laughs> There's a happy look on his face. Yeah. Oh, God. Look at dog. That's terrible. It's like Home Alone. You come out now, No one's gonna hurt you. <laughs> they are legit like pirates. Katuni, where are you guys? No time to explain. Just close the door. Artin, close the door. <laughs> hey, what's what's going on? <laughs> oh, uh. I think I'd eventually kill him. What if one of them has a heart condition? Yeah. He just shot and he dies. Just because he's like, hee hee hee. Like, if you held on to electric fence out there long enough, you'd die. So yeah. I'm just saying, if you just get stung by a million bees, you'd die. I can't make it. I love how they're. <laughs> well, children, you have put up quite a fight. Kill your ass. <laughs> the Jedi Council will not take kindly to this attack. Ahsoka, how will they know who is responsible if there is no one left to tell the tale? You want the crystals? Come and get them. Why go against a Jedi, dude? You're not gonna win. Oh, easy enough. Hurry, hurry. What about Ahsoka? Trust her, now get in there. God damn! How dare you! Chewy, see you, Bill. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty sure in canon there's like a an air sh there's like yeah, a they'd come up. You're fucked, pal. That sucks. Fuck up on you, kind of. Oh, Professor. Bring him here. I'll fix him. I think that should be Donnie's voice. <laughs> you have cost me greatly today, young one. And since you lost me so much profit, I am left with no choice. But to turn you into profit. Kind of menacing with the lip. Just hit some 14 year old girl and do that to her lip. Yeah, it's a weird. Yeah. I actually really liked it a lot more than the first one. I thought it ended really well. Yeah. I it ended like a fuck with a bang. Like, you know, like it's, it's just like these kids just being kids, not listening to what they're doing. But in the end, it's going to be the so thing that ends up saying. I thought that would be a beer can. I'm like, oh, that's all on me. It's a fucking Mountain Dew can. Yeah, your beer can't fall off earlier. <laughs> yeah, so we're not gonna. I was on the table, though. Yeah, I did, yeah it was Malachi. You knocked it off by accident. What did you think of uh, Hugh Wang? Like, 
this, dr- well, ancient, like this ancient droid, the idea of like kind of assisting with mm. young Padawans. It reminds they... me of the one from. Um... What is the name of that game? Um, Star Wars, Knights of the Old Republic? Yeah, KOTOR. Yeah. You had that droid. It was like AK-70. It's not AK-47, but it was something. Yeah, HK. He's an H- It reminds you of, though, of that AK-47. Yeah. Player, but he's like an assassin droid. Yeah. And you reminded me of kind of like that, of these old droids. Yeah. They're, they're, they're ancient, but they're... Yeah, but, and I like that idea. I don't like the shiny new droids, like the, the B-1s. Like what I loved about the droidicas is that they looked like something industrial. Mm-hmm. Something about the B-1s looks cartoonish. I think it's their heads. Yeah, they're, they're supposed to, I think that the, they were designed by the Geonosians. They have that look. I get that, but the Droidicas, those things... They look like a fierce aversion. It, but no, not like anything like them, really. The Droidicas are badass. Well, yeah, they are, but they look they look like something that's industrial. Like, you can see, like, like because of the collar mm-hmm. and the mechanics and everything that's exposed. I yeah. The B1, something about them, the slender look and, like, the cartoonish heads. Slender, goofy, weak. Yeah. 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 Well, even, <laughs> even the Super Battle Droids, I loved them when we were younger. Yeah. But even they are not as cool as the fucking Droidicas, man. The Droidicas are the coolest. They are the fucking ba- most yeah. badass droids. Yeah, I, I do love them quite a bit. I, I like the idea of him, too. I like the idea well, of I mean, of I like the voice actors that lend that, that kind of... Is my shtick, I guess. So yeah. I like the actor, then I'm probably going like to like the role. You like the story for the actor. <laughs> yeah. So it's like, I, I like it for them. Yeah. And it's not, I mean, it's not especially true. I, I love Daniel Day Lewis, but I don't love all of his fucking movies. I also think it is Harry Potter that kind of makes me like the story of the role as well, too. I like the one guy. I think it's just a cool. It's funny that it's from a Harry Potter alumni doing it. Yeah. You know, kind of like this. And how he's like. But he's this, already a voice actor. It's, it's cool that he's a voice actor. I like that. Yeah. Well, he's like this arrogant droid. Like, I've been doing this for thousands of years. I know every single Well, I saw him in, of course, Harry Potter. I'm like, I mean, he's kind of. Hey, over, father. He's over the top <laughs> yeah, in little, that role. He's a little crazy, yeah. In that movie. But after I heard him as Scrooge, and I've heard him in other. I know he's in Doctor Who, but. He's I've, a lot of people's favorite it. doctor. But. Um, I think he's great. But my favorite doctor is Matt Smith. But David Tennant is. He's amazing. He's had some of the best stories. and I haven't seen Matt Smith as that. I've only seen him in House of the Dragon. I could not stand his fucking character in House of the Dragon. Yeah. I mean, I know he's he's loyal to certain characters in that, yeah. which makes him cool, but not that cool. To me, he's just kind of a douchebag that he still owed his due. Well, I think, yeah, I think he did a good job. I think he's just part of the Targaryen that, you know, you could be a little crazy. I think he uh, Well, fucking that. his brother wasn't crazy. Well, it's because they said when a Targaryen's bo- born, you flip a coin. You know, they're going to be this benevolent, great guy, or they're going to be this terrible person. I, I was really surprised by the ending, and I was surprised. Uh, it's a little brutal, like her to get clubbed in the head, and her and him to kind of like do that to her. It was a little, it was a little. What? Oh, that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that was kind of uh, almost like sexual. Yeah, in a weird way. Thing. And I'm not in like a, like oh he's yeah not in a, because I know she's like 14. <laughs> What's well, what makes it fucking weird? Yeah. And she's like uh, she's underage. Yeah. So and. Yeah, you don't know. Yeah. It's a little weird to me. Yeah. Very fucking weird. But it also, because, like, he's not a villain that's supposed to be creepy. His villain's supposed to be, like, this funny... Yeah, he should have been, like, a, on the chin. Like, nudged up on the chin. Yeah. And, like, he's supposed to be, like, this swashbuckling yeah, fuck-up. Goofy. That always gets yeah. away. Right? Yeah. Uh, but, no, I, I really liked it. I thought it was a really good episode. So. No, that was good. Yeah. Uh, anyways, guys, if you want to support us, you can go to Patreon. We have four weeks early access by now, hopefully. If not, I'm going to feel like an idiot. We're out of here.